Alright folks, here I go again with another beautiful 2011 Ford Crown Victoria. Now, before I forget, folks, this vehicle is not for sale. It already, it belongs to someone already. Customer brought the vehicle in, gave me very detailed instructions on what he wanted done on the vehicle. And I followed those instructions right to the bottom of the letter. All right, folks, stay with me. Once again, this vehicle is not for sale. It's being fully outfitted for a customer. Um, this is something that I do every now and then, but you do have to have the proper credentials if you want anything to this extent. All right, here we go. I'm not gonna get into many details, but I am gonna walk through the vehicle and show you guys what we done to it. All right, folks, here we go. This is going to be a 2011 Ford Crown Victoria Police Interceptor. Vehicle was completely repainted, all black, all over again. She drives very well. The customer didn't instruct me to do any type of uh, mechanical repair on this vehicle, so I went ahead and left it alone, and I took care of everything else. Folks, this vehicle is fully equipped with working emergency equipment stay tuned we will walk around this vehicle and i will show you what we got going on once again folks this vehicle is not for sale and it belongs to someone already i do have one hole in the trunk where this actual antenna is it's not going anywhere so if you need to drive your car through the express car wash it's going to stay put it's going to be solid and in place before i forget all four steel wheels were reconditioned when the vehicle first arrived yes all four steel wheels will look bad and uh, I went ahead and reconditioned all four of them so they do look nice and new all over again. The paint looks amazing. As you guys can see, I do have two uh, working spotlights with new Unity LED bulbs. Once again, new Unity LED bulbs upon request by my customer. I do have a... Uh, front go right in a push bar that came with the car we had to take that off and uh before we started the paint i do have two brand new original equipment headlights that was requested by the customer i do have those here in stock so i went ahead and swapped those out after the car got painted front grill was reconditioned repainted and it does look does look new all over again and yes folks it matches the whole car that siren that you, you guys see right there, it's, it's not up, it's just there for looks. All right, folks, let's go inside and show you what we got to work with. As you guys can see in the rear deck, I do have a full LED uh, uh, light bar. Panels were removed. Had this installed in there. Petitioner cage in place, vinyl plastic floor, hard seat in place with the seat belts and buckles. Once again, folks, this is what the customer requested and this is what we're gonna give him. All right, so fully protected folks, you're not going anywhere. <laughs> now this is where it gets good. I do have uh, ballistic door panels inside the front door so the doors are kind of heavy. So ballistic door panels are in place in this unit. Folks, and this is what I got here for you. I do have a full Troy center console, police type center console. Working lights, working siren, with working PA. I do have a working Code 3 arrow stick. I do have a Code 3 wingman rear bar, uh, light bar in the back.
Stay tuned, folks. You're going to want to see this one. All right. Yeah, this is the paint. Brand new paint, folks. When the first, when the car first arrived, uh, she had already been painted black by someone else. However, the paint wasn't of uh, good quality. So a uh, customer wanted me to repaint, repaint his vehicle. So we had to destroy whatever was already there. And yeah, believe me, folks, it was a lot of work. So we had to destroy whatever was already on the vehicle and prep primer and do a bunch of uh, steps to get this paint to look this good and believe me folks this is not this is not your fifteen hundred dollar Mako paint job I repeat a lot of guys believe that I take my cars to Mako no Mako paint job is only good maybe for six months to a year depending how good you take care of it after that good luck to you all right let's get let's get in the vehicle <sighs> let's go ahead and fire her up Vehicle does have 109,000 miles. All right, folks, stay tuned. I'm gonna try to do my best here to show you what we got. I got a little map light right here. It does work. Slide it and it's white, and then you push it back up. I like to keep it in red, especially at night. This is what you wanna have, okay? It's got the switch right here in the side. You turn it over. And it turns off. You can you can dim it as much as you want, so you can keep it really low, or you can keep it high. Touchmaster siren system here module, aero stick controller for the light bar in the back. Position one gets activated. Let's get to the back. Position one will activate the rear lights only. I do have six clear working strobes in this vehicle, four in the back, two in the front. Oop, I blurred it right there. All right, let's continue. Sorry, folks. Let me see if I can clean it up from here. Oh, I guess not. All right, let's continue. The lights is throwing me off. There you go. You do have the takedown, you turn that on, it brings out the uh, front LED lights right there. Let me hurry up because the clock is ticking. Position two. We'll light up the front. Position two brings out the uh, red and blues on the front visor only. Let's go ahead and turn off the takedown lights and go to position three. Position three activates everything. Clear strobes in each corner light. Red, blue LEDs behind the grill. Wig wags on the front. Mirror beams red and blue. And yes, the lights. So everything's working and you can control the arrow stick if you just want to do the arrow stick alone by itself. Air horn. I don't want to hit the siren, folks. I'm not hearing the siren because, folks, uh, my neighbors are probably going to come out and run out of the house. Let's turn this off. Arrow stick. That's work. You power that on and it comes live. Okay, so center. Let's go to the center. And my minutes are running out, folks, so stay with me. That'll be the center right there. Uh, 
right. Right. Flash pattern. This is the flash pattern right there. We're gonna do left. There you go, so that works too. Power it. PA system does work as well. Again, folks, it's pretty loud. It's pretty loud, it does work, I tried it. Believe me, folks, I tried it. All right, folks, here we go. One last final look at this beautiful 2011 Ford Crown Victoria with working emergency equipment on. Ready for work, folks, ready for work. Any questions, please feel free to give me a call, text me, email me. Once again, this vehicle is not for sale. It already belongs to a customer. You know what I forgot to show you guys? LEDs. Folks, this is the Crown Victoria guy signing off. You guys have yourself a blessed week out there ahead of you. And thanks for staying with me for, this, for these 12 minutes. Once again, folks, these vehicles not for sale. It is a 2011 and she's going back to work.